All right, if we are live. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Find Your Journey. Today, we have Wendy Lynn from Lickety Split Scrapbooks with us. <laughs> and um, she has sailed on 24 cruising crops, and she has her 25th coming up on, in February on the Liberty of the Seas on February 20th. They have three awesome days of crafting at sea. They're going to Roatan, Costa Maya, and Cozumel. And on the Liberty of the Seas, you will find the perfect storm water slide, the tidal wave slide, the flow rider surf simulator, rock climbing wall, ice skating rink, and so much more. There's Broadway shows and the casino, so, so much fun. And if you want to double your fun, we do have a back-to-back -back cruising crop. So if you're interested in booking two, um, give us a call. Okay, Wendy. So tell us a little bit about yourself and your business. Hi, I'm Wendy with Lickety Split Scrapbooks, and my focus is page kits, and that's what you find on my website. Um, and then I do my cruises on the side, which I have been going through withdrawals without them, so we were really excited to get back in October and have this started back up again. Yeah. Um, normally I do two a year. Um, this year we only have the one, of course, in October, and then we have two scheduled for next year, and then one in 2023. So um, I love it. Cruising's the way for me, and if you've never scrapbooked and cruised, it's amazing. Everyone always asks me, how do you get everything done on one? You know, <laughs> pick and choose and have fun. Yep. It's your vacation. Our vacations are very laid back. I mean, I'm very low key. I don't do the rush, 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 rush. You got to do this at a certain time, um, especially the February cruise. That's my big one. That's out of Galveston. I do that one every other year, and... Um, that one's a lot of fun. It's got a lot of repeats, and we have a blast on that one. So we don't really focus on classes for that cruise. Okay, awesome. Um, can you tell us about what self-paced projects you're including in your crop feed? And if you have any examples, can you show us? Sure. Um, for, like I said, February's cruise, that one's out of Galveston. I do it every other year. So every even-numbered year is normally when I go out of Galveston in the spring. And I give you six page kits to work on. Sometimes it's seven or eight, depending on how, how much I like the paper and how creative I get. Um, and then we do two little projects. Usually those are self-paced on this cruise just because there's so many people and everyone comes and goes at different times. I leave the crop room, crop room open 24 seven. And you've got the first timers that are never in the room. They're off seeing the ship everywhere and having so much fun. <laughs> And then they think, oh my gosh, I missed the class, and they get upset. So this one is pretty laid back, and we don't do um, very many classes. But like on October's cruise that I just got back from, we did an ABC album. Oh, cute. And if you've never done an ABC album, it's so that you get to know your ship. You sit there and take a picture for every letter of the alphabet. Oh. And like this one, you've got, we were on the Allure. And so then you're going to find an A and put oh. your A. So if your waiter's name is Alberto, you can put a picture of your waiter there. That's awesome. And then we go to the ship and you take pictures for every letter of the alphabet. And that's how you get to know your ship. And in the, in the crop room, everyone's comparing, oh, what'd you use for an X or what'd you use for a Y? And it gets pretty fun. Um, sometimes we do a journal. This was one for Galveston that we did in 2018. And it's just a little journal. We stamp and then we give you a little tab so you can put this cruise on there and then write in it. And then when you get to the end, you, let's say you start here, put another tab for the next cruise. And that way you have a little journal. Wish I'd been doing this all along because I've done 25 cruises. I don't remember anything. <laughs> this is an album that they got in October. Our yeah. theme was the Seagulls. Oh, uh, cute. So they got an album that was custom painted. And then they got all these pages. Now my cruisers all get, I don't know if you can see it with the glare. I can see it. But yep. All the cruisers get at least six pages, uh, six layouts. So that's 12 pages. And then my repeat customers get additional pages, additional goodies, just to reward them for coming on. Awesome. <laughs> that's awesome. Okay, and you said you do leave the, the crop room open the whole time, so there's open oh, crop yeah. room? It's 24-7. Okay. Yeah. They don't lock the crop room, but there's cameras everywhere. Right. Knock on wood. 
We haven't had anything <laughs> happen to anything in 24 cruises. So it's it's pretty nice. They've got cameras if something did, if someone wandered in off the streets and <laughs> wandered around, we would right. know about it. So. Okay. All right. And you mentioned your repeats get extra um, pages. Um, so that's they how you make do. them feel special for coming back. They do. They get at least six extra layouts. Oh, so awesome. that's 12 extra pages. So you, right. they walk off with an entire album pretty much when they get that's through. Awesome. It's 24 pages long at least. Wow. Um, then they get an extra t-shirt. So like this year, I don't even remember what year this was. This was 2016 shirt. Okay. So everyone got an orange one and then the others got a different color one. Okay. So the repeats get one color, newbies get another color. And when we take our group photo, the repeats wear their different colored shirts. So okay. it looks kind of cool in the group photos. Right. Awesome. Um, so we just, we can, we add a little extra something, something to their bags because they get, um, in October, we gave away a diamond dot and mm -hmm. a light pad and everyone got those. And then the repeats got a little extra something. So nice. we, we just try to keep it fun for them. We've got on um, Galveston is always the biggest repeats. I think on this next one, there's 25 repeats, something like that. So it's right. like half the people are repeats. Right, right. Yeah. So, we have a um, lot of fun. Yeah, it sounds like it. Um, so for this cruise, have you been to any of these ports of call? And what are your favorite activities? Well, girl, I've um, been to Galveston every other year. So I've been to all yeah. these ports of calls a lot of the time. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. Yes. <laughs> um, Cozumel is pretty basic. Everyone goes to Cozumel. It seems like it's on almost every cruise. Yes. So um, that one, I like to go to Mr. Sancho's, which is not an excursion through Royal Caribbean. Right. So I'm not sure if that one is even an option coming up because of all the COVID stuff. I'm not mm -hmm. sure. We didn't try that in October. I don't even remember what I did in Cozumel in October. <laughs> I don't even remember. But um, whenever we, Honduras is one of my favorites. I love when we hit Honduras. It has all the monkeys and the iguanas and all the little places that you can go see the critters. And I'm a critter person, so right. I'm all about the photos. I've got to have the animals in it. Yes. So that one, um, speaking of animals, the October, I mean, the February theme for this year is going to be monkeys. Monkeys, awesome. Monkeys, monkeys. because we have the Honduras is on that port. So we're going to have monkeying around and different layouts like that so if you like awesome. monkeys that that will be our theme and you'll get very good at putting paper pieces together <laughs> that sounds Ladies, fun. if you have not been to my website it is lickety-split-scrapbooks.com <laughs> look at my layouts if you don't like that style <laughs> we're not for you baby <laughs> we do lots of paper piecing i mean look at the cover page for october oh yeah paper piecing. a lot of pieces <laughs> we need to do lots of them. Now, I almost got shot for this year. This last, what year was this one? This one was, hmm, it was my 20th cruise, so whenever that was. You see that little flamingo? There's like oh, yeah. 20 or 30 of them going through this book. Oh, wow. I got fussed out on this one. <laughs> we have lots and lots of little flamingos that people put together. Well, thank you. <laughs> they got very good at it, and once they're done, they're adorable. So, um, I'm not artsy fartsy. I'm straight up page kits is what I do. That is my bread and butter. That's what's on the website. And um, of course, before you book a cruise with us, we send you a discount code so you can go shop on, bring on extra goodies. Um, but yeah. Definitely check out. I'm very laid back. I don't do strict classes. Not on this cruise. February is not. Now, my Australia cruise, we'll be doing classes because that one is an 18-day cruise. Yes. <laughs> so, we have like four or five classes lined up for that one. That one will have classes. We have lots of sale days on that one. Yes. So, yeah. um, but for this one, I don't do classes. Okay. All right. So, there are still some spots available on your upcoming cruise. Um, the Royal Caribbean does have the 30% off rates, so the inside cabins are starting at 336. So anybody who's not booked, you have to call to get booked. And if you want a balcony, um, just call and we'll give you some more rates. Um, so Wendy's also sailing October of next year to Bermuda. And like she said, she's going to Australia. That's April of 2023. So if you're interested, give us a call or shoot us an email with some questions and we'll be happy to get you booked. Um, and if you ever have questions for me, email me. The link is on my website. Just email, and I can answer any questions that you might have about 
what we're going to do. I can't help you on the cruise end of it, but right. I can help you on what we're going to do and if you need help with anything. Okay, awesome. Um, and I'll post a link below um, for Winnie's Cruises for anybody who's interested. If you have any questions, just um, feel free to email us or give us a call. Um, and thank you so much for joining us today, Wendy. It was nice to Bye-bye. Bye. You too. Bye.